Guys, he does say to oh, this Jeremiah and VDM case, the thing is taken to another level by VDM. <laughs> hey, for the interest of those who have not been following this gist, this prophet Jeremiah Omoto Fufei uh, have miracle water that he is selling to his church members. I don't know if it is only to his church members or everyone. Maybe it's everyone because... Uh, VDM, very dark man, he ordered for that miracle water, the miracle hanky, the miracle key. And everything that Jeremiah said that those things are doing, uh, VDM have to take those items to where there are people with uh, disabilities to see if those things, if the waters and everything is doing everything that Jeremiah said it is doing. But unfortunately, uh, none of those miracle items who work on the people with uh, disabilities that he went to visit with a bag of rice, I think, yes. So, unfortunately for Jeremiah, it did not work. And VDM, being who he is, he did not keep quiet about it. He started dragging Jeremiah, saying that he is selling fake. <laughs> So my people, oh, instead of Jeremiah to go and rest, knowing that he is just doing his business, that those things are not working as he stated, he went and uh, filed a lawsuit against VDM, saying that VDM will have to pay him one billion naira and stop talking about him. VDM, on the other hand, is very much prepared. The next thing he did was to go to uh, NAVDAC, I saw the video where he went to NAVDAC to go and report that product because the product in question does not have NAVDAC approved. <laughs> hey, my people right now, internet on the shake over this matter. And a lot of people have come out to come and advise this uh, prophet Jeremiah Omoto Ofufoye to go and relax, to withdraw the case because he is going to lose in court. Now, let me just play one of the videos uh, of a Nigerian lawyer advising um, Fufei. Let me just play the video for you, okay? The next voice you will hear right now is the video. Just watch. Entity, that how do you see this case if it's going to be contested in the courts? Do you know out of the three of them, they say almost the same thing. They say the prophet will be so much abused, disgraced in the court of law. If this case proceeds to the courts, that the very dark man evidences, and with the way very dark man is taking this case, if this case appear in the court, that the man of God might be rubbished. So when we are saying that very dark man is not fighting churches, is not fighting the body of Christ, this is a pure mistake that was made by this our senior prophet, and he should accept the mistake and move on. After us. T.B. Joshua has been dragged. Nobody sued anybody. Adeboye has been dragged. Oyedekbo has been dragged. Kumuye somehow has been dragged. Some uh, Adeyemi has been dragged. Uh, who again? Make sure their name. Apostle Suleiman has been dragged. Uh, David Bumin has been dragged. Uh, Pastor, uh, this pastor for Dunamis, he has also been dragged. So many men of God. They have been dragged by blogger one way. So many men of God, they have been dragged by blogger one way or the other. So taking very dark man to court or see very dark man, a lot of this are going to come out. I mean, of you knew that very dark man can go to the extent of coming to order for the, the, the so-called controversial prayer water and whatever, and at the end, he will use them in this manner. With the way very dark man is going on this, Every Christian, forget blaming dark man. Let's cast the stone to the right direction. The prophet supposed not to have seen sue dark man to court. Secondly, this item are supposed to be removed from wherever they set them at the church. That is my stake, and I stand for my word. No apology for anybody. I'm just be frank, and you can call it on your microphone and on your camera and be frank as well. So guys, I'm sure you heard what that lawyer said about uh, Prophet Jeremiah suing very dark man for one billion naira, all because of 
uh, the Miracle products. See, this is what I have to say on this. What Very Dark Man did was a review of the products he bought from Jeremiah. And Jeremiah himself knows very well that that miracle uh, water is not doing all he said it is doing. Because if it is doing so, by the time Very Dark Man used it on these people, he would have seen the effects as in the result. The thing would have done what Jeremiah said they are doing. And I know that if it had it been it happened that way, all of this dragging wouldn't have been happening. As a matter of fact, the same Very Dark Man might even go as far as uh, 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 um, advertising that for Jeremiah. But we all know that a uh, very dark man called himself an activist. And whenever he sees things like this that people are using to deceive the masses, he is not going to keep quiet. So the best thing Jeremiah would have done is to overlook all things, continue with his business, or even find a way to cover his shame, his shame by, you know, pushing those business one place because it is not good to tell people that this thing is doing this. When they buy it, it will not do it. You keep telling them, eh, your faith wasn't strong. You don't have faith. Miracle. Miraculous things are supposed to be miracle and special gift from God. You don't have to sell them for any reason if that is the case. For my own understanding, no. Uh -huh. So going to sue very dark man. <laughs> You just want to bring your legs outside so that people that do not know you very well, they are going to know you. And I bet you, when this case continue, Jeremiah is going to lose members. Jeremiah is going to lose people that patronizes this water business that he just started, you know, and everything. That is my own opinion. Though. And this young barrister that said this now, is giving him the best advice to withdraw the case that if he decides to go ahead, proceed with the case, a lot of things will be exposed. A whole lot. <laughs> One thing about this church thing is that once you know what you are doing, just mind your business. After all, you are not the first man of God to be dragged in this manner. And you are coming out even when you know that you all are the same. Mm -hmm. I'm not trying to say that uh, you are fake or you are original. Is not in my place to say that. But what I'm saying is that uh, suing very dark man is out of it. You should have lived it for God if you believe that. If you think that you have you worship God and God can fight for you, you should have lived it for God. Uh -huh. But sometimes God wants to use certain things to expose certain things. Anyway, guys, that is my own review and opinion. Tell me what to think about it on the comment section and give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you're yet to subscribe. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. My God will bless you. I'm seeing you again. Touch you with love. Bye. Love you guys.